Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So we just got finished hiking Pilot Butte in the middle of Bend. Um, it was a two mile hike. We really tested Louie's socialization and leash skills because it was a pretty tight trail with kids running up and down, babies in strollers, a bunch of dogs, and just all sorts of smells for Louie. So as usual, he was just smelling around and uh, pulling on the leash a lot. But all in all, I think he did do well because in the past he has broke out and barked at people and stuff in those situations so he didn't bark this time and it was just some leash pulling that needs correction needs more um, work but all in all I think he did pretty well I'll show you guys our hike so we're walking up the butte and Louie just does not stop smelling everything come on he stops and smells literally everything and pees on everything but we're still out here and we're still giving him some exercise as well as ourselves, then we get this really great view of Ben. So we made it to the top, so it's a mile up and a mile down, so it's round trip, two miles. It's a really nice hike to have with your dog. He's definitely enjoying it, he just keeps smelling everything. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna head down now. Come on. Louis definitely gets really curious, he's really anxious, he smells everything, he pees on everything. So I'm definitely going to be bringing him here more so he gets used to it and I think our walks will be a lot better than say this one because he is like smelling every single thing but I think he just does that with new places and once we do it more he'll definitely get used to it. finished with our hike Louis is definitely kicked he is back there just panting and very tired <laughs> but overall I think he did really well I enjoyed the hike I wanted to hike 
there and I know there's a lot of people and kids and stuff but it's good for him to be around that so I just force us into these situations so he gets better and better and uh, he used to not be able to walk by a dog without freaking out and he'd whine and cry until he was able to meet the dog or touch noses with the dog and now he's been walking by dogs like they're nothing like he he doesn't care he got a little too close to one and he you can see his shark fin on the back of his fur puffed up um, but other than that he was really good with the dogs so that's about it for this video guys if you liked it please give it a thumbs up it really supports our channel please subscribe for more content from us and if you are subscribed don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified every time we post a new video and we'll see you in the next one bye